Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're learning about adding, subtracting decimals. I'm going to evaluate each expression. So, if I was given this problem, negative 13.6 plus 12 minus a negative 15.5. All right. First thing I do here is minus a negative, same thing as adding a positive. So 13.6 plus 12 plus a positive 15.5. Okay? Well, since these two numbers are positive, uh, I'm just going to add them together first. Okay? I'm going to kind of deal with that on the side. 12 plus 15.5. Make sure the decimal points line up. We have 12.0s, put a 0 there to match it. 0 plus 5 is 5. Decimal point comes down. 2 plus 5 is 7. 1 plus 1 is 2, so now we have 27.5. Let's go put that here. Negative 13.6 plus, these two came together, 27.5. But I'm not done, right? Well, we know that adding that negative here, right, 27.5 is the same thing as subtracting. So, but to get there, I'm just going to flip the plus sign in case you don't know. Flip the, uh, around the plus sign because we can rearrange this. And so we have 27.5 plus a negative 13.6. Okay, then adding a negative, same thing as subtraction, 27.5 minus 13.6, okay? And you, at some point, we'll be able to jump from here to here, but if not, uh, you need to do these steps and we'll get there. So let's go subtract these two, 27.5 minus 13.6, okay? Subtract them, well, 5 minus 6, oh, I can't do that, right? So get one from the 7, that becomes a 6, add a 1. 15 minus 6 is just good old 9. Decimal place stays there. 6 minus 3 is a 3. 2 minus 1 is a 1. 13.9 is just my final answer. So quick recap. We're given negative 13.6 plus 12 minus a negative 15.5. And we have to evaluate that. Well, adding a negative is plus a positive. Added these two numbers together, got 27.5. Then I rearranged negative 13.6 plus 27.5 to be 27.5 minus 13.6. They mean the same thing. Then I moved, <laughs> moved, moved over here and uh, subtracted. So I have 27.5 minus 13.6, got 13.9. So 13.9 is just my final answer.